I've, I've been living in Lebanon for ooh, about seven years now, and um, during my time, I've noticed so much of the heritage, so much of the culture and identity of Lebanon is being destroyed. You know, obviously a lot was damaged in the civil war, and now uh, developers are wiping away um, this heritage at an alarming rate. And, you know, it saddens me, and it upsets a lot of people around me. And I believe that uh, we can uh, save some of these buildings and reinvent them as places of culture and beauty. And uh, I've done two projects uh, so far. Uh, Villa Paradiso in Jamezi, and, and, uh, and then another one, that's the Rose House uh, in Manat, in Brasfield. And in both cases, uh, I discovered disused or deserted buildings. Um, and I persuaded the owners to transform the space with me. Um, and I did my exhibition. And during my exhibition, I invited artists uh, and musicians to come and collaborate with me. Uh, and so these places came, became living senses of creativity again. But my projects are very much, in a sense, about memory. Um, a kind of nostalgia, but also uh, this sense of loss that a lot of people feel. And this is a very human uh, feeling which is common to people from many countries, but it's particularly relevant to Lebanon um, that had this crisis, this trauma of the Civil War. Um, but I feel this spirit in Lebanon is still alive. There's this sense of freedom of expression, the kind of um, joie de vivre, and this, uh, this, this sense of creativity which I find really inspiring. And so I just want to join in and uh, bring these places alive again. Um, and during my projects, uh, I really love to invite children to come as well, uh, to learn, to draw, to paint, and we collaborate together. And so in this exhibition, uh, I've exhibited my paintings about Beirut and some of the buildings that I've worked in, and a building which I would like to work in, uh, which is the, the infamous Holiday Inn here behind me. Um, and uh, I've also exhibited drawings by children, um, many of whom are, are, are disadvantaged children from, uh, from the streets, um, from the home of Hope Orphanage near Beirut, um, the Lebanese, uh, Palestinian and Syrian children, and also Syrian refugee children. Uh, yeah, there's this great crisis at the moment, and I feel that we have to respond some way, in some way. And uh, so I invited these children to come to the Rose House when I was uh, doing my exhibition there. And I believe that these places, these great palaces, these beautiful houses, should be open to everybody, and not just the rich, but also disadvantaged, disadvantaged people, people who are on the margins of society. And this is a way that art can really contribute something positive to society. In this painting, which actually doesn't exist at the moment, it's more of a vis uh, visualisation or a concept for what I'd like to do in the Holiday Inn. Um, this place has always been a kind of symbol of conflict and violence. And it's been occupied since uh, the Civil War by the Lebanese army. And no one can go in. And it's like an elephant in the room. You know, it's surrounded by these gleaming new sort of steel and glass towers, you know, many of which are uninhabited. Um, and this building remains you know, guarded, empty, like a testament to all that's wrong with humanity. And I feel that uh, if I can get permission to do an intervention here um, and to to transform it into a place of, of culture and creativity. That will be a great symbol, and will send out a great message that if something beautiful can happen here, it can happen anywhere.
really love this drawing because I love the colour, I love the way it was drawn, I love the way that it was drawn over the, the Rose House. Um, I think, you know, we've just been to Beirut uh, for, for a week and we loved it and we could see what was happening there and the fact that this was drawn by a Syrian refugee um, and it was just about perhaps helping her and you know I really feel for those children I work a little bit with children um, very fortunate children but I really feel for the children who are not so fortunate in the world very important for uh, our country. I mean, uh, to have someone to, to highlight what's going on, the knocking down of the old buildings and uh, the preservation of the old ones, I, I think it's a very important, uh, you know, thing to do. was this one. I really, really love it. It reminds me of my grandparents' house that has now been demolished, um, which is such a shame. And they're building like a big skyscraper instead um, in the middle of Asha Um But really, the layout is, I can't believe how exactly the layout is exactly the same with the tall ceilings and the glass. And it's lovely, absolutely. 